joined by some guests this morning here from Degrassi. I want to introduce Sarah Fisher and Anna Golia. Thanks for joining us. Thanks Thank for you having for us. This <laughs> is a really big day for you because this is the season finale of season 13 of Degrassi and it's happening tonight 9 p.m. on MTV but also there's some really cool things happening in our parking lot. Yes, tonight we have the finale party. We usually do a premiere party. This is our first finale party, our which very is really first. cool. So it's going to be exciting having the fans in the parking lot, uh, taking pictures with them, signing autographs. And the, uh, the incredible thing that we were just talking about, actually, is just that a lot of fans come from so far away. So like, I feel far. bad. I'm, I'm driving 20 minutes or so to get here. <laughs> and people and, are driving eight hours from New York. And for and all of you who are coming, honestly, thank you so much. We love support. you guys. It just means. the fact that they're coming from so far, it's just... We really love our fans. Oh, so. well, you guys have a huge fan base. I mean, Degrassi has had a huge fan base for so, so many years. Oh, yeah. uh, so let's talk a little bit about maybe, uh, I don't know if you can give away any spoilers, but sort of what we can expect in the finale tonight. Well, for Zoe, <laughs> there's a bit of a love triangle, you could say. Mm. Um, Zig is caught in the middle between Zoe and Maya, and they are caught in a storm. And you can say that things get intense. Oh, like like an actual storm? Because it is called Thunderstruck. Right. Or do you mean it like a storm of love? Both. Both. <laughs> it's very dramatic. Both. Oh, nice. Okay. And what about for your character? Um, well, Becky's, uh, Becky and Zoe has just, have just been through so much. And mm. so what's, what's really cool about the last episode is that this thunderstorm or thunderstruck mm -hmm. is, um, is kind of bringing a lot of characters together who don't usually communicate. So what's Absolutely. cool is it's is it's kind of bring the Zig and Zoe story back. Um, for Becky, Becky and Drew, they uh, they don't really have as much as they have. They share a really strong relationship with um, Adam, Adam, that character. Um, they've never really um, gotten to know each other either. So what's cool about the storm is that it brings it. Everyone kind of gets trapped physically and emotionally. <laughs> and, um, in different positions they've never been in. So it's gonna be really cool because everyone comes together on this one. I watched the trailer. There's like a slow-mo of you about to kiss someone. I'm just saying, I saw that. <laughs> it was like, it was very dramatic. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the fans because you, you have a chance to meet them today in our parking lot, but are you surprised by the reaction? I should also say congratulations on the Emmy nomination as well, which is so thank cool. Thank you very much. Uh, because obviously people are really, you know, taking to the show and you guys are resonating with them. So what's your reaction to the reaction you get? Honestly, the reaction has been absolutely incredible. Never did I ever think I would get the response that I have. Um, personally, I started off as the very mean, negative character, and I had a few haters in the beginning, but as Zoe grew as a character and as a person, um, the fans have been gearing towards my side now, mm, yeah. especially with everything that Zoe's gone through. I mean, how could you not, really? Oh, for sure. But it's it's cool because with every character, like with Becky, she she had a very similar um, beginning with her character was that she seemed very black and white and she was very um, conservative. Yeah. conservative. And, and it was really interesting because with the series of all these characters, they're so deep and there's so much more going on. Um, which is why this last storyline is incredible because they break down that shell of what everyone thinks, thinks they, they are, are. Mm. and you get to see real struggle with both characters and that's when you learn a lot about someone is how they is how they, how they deal with things and yeah. react with things so it's really cool to get in through the shell and have people actually see the deeper layers of both characters. Well, we're so looking forward to it. You want to tune in. Don't forget 9 o'clock on MTV. And of course, uh, there's the amazing stuff that's happening in our parking lot. I'm not sure if it's too late to register, but you can always go to MTV.ca to see if you can still get uh, definitely, the RSVP. Definitely. Yes. So uh, you Come can maybe out. even Dude, join them. Do want to see you. Yes. <laughs> Thanks for joining us, ladies. Thanks Thank for you. having us.